I know going to church on Sundays can be boring. The homily can be long, the choir can sing horribly. Of course, not if the YFL choir sings, but you never know. Um, it can be boring. Uh, and sometimes it can be difficult maybe to understand why we have to go on some days. But just know that if you are not there, something and someone is missing in the body of Christ. The body of Christ is less complete if you are not there. So just by living our faith, by participating in the parish life and coming to church on Sundays, we give witness to Christ. And he is the one who has to create the unity. We cannot do that. We have to bring people to Christ. Hello, my name is Paul Bratbach. Uh, I've been a priest now for nine years, and the last four years I've served as the parish priest in the cathedral in Oslo. And it's a wonderful parish that I serve there. It's in the middle of Oslo, and we have more or less 12,000 parishioners from approximately 140 different countries. And every Sunday, around 3,000 of them come together for Sunday Mass in one of our between 15 and 17 Sunday Masses. And for me to see this is like experiencing Pentecost every Sunday, where people from all over the world come together as one. We do not have any parking places. We have two toilets. We have people from all over the world, different kind of people, and no wars. And this for me is an experience of Pentecost. As the parish priest of this very mixed community, uh, I try to live by the words of the slogan, in essentials, unity, in non-essentials, liberty, and in all things, charity. Charity, I think, is a key word, also for unity. It creates unity between us and God, but also among people, between people. Ubi caritas et amor Deus ibi est. Where there is love, there God is. So charity creates unity. And the Eucharist creates unity. Whenever we come together as the people of God, the body of Christ becomes visible. And for me, the greatest experience of this is when we celebrate the yearly solemnity of the body and blood of Christ, the Corpus Christi. And in our parish, we do that by merging many of our morning masses into one big mass, where all the different languages and groups and traditions come together in one big church and we celebrate Mass together. Where all the different groups, all the different nationalities can put their flavor on the liturgy through the music. Being Catholic, belonging to one Catholic church, a universal church, is for me the greatest gift that my parents gave me when they had me baptized into this body and I became a member of this church, this body. And we need each other because we are different. And our diversity is not a threat because we are one in the essential. We are one in Christ. And because we are one in Christ, we can give each other great liberty in the less essential as long as we remember to do everything in charity. We are united together in Christ.